solving a two-step linear inequality with a fractional coefficient. Solve the inequality for v. Negative 1 is less than or equal to 4 subtract 5v divided by 4. Simplify your answer as much as possible. So when we start, we're going to try to first get rid of the fraction. So we're just going to multiply everything by 4. If we keep things in the same proportion by multiplying everything by 4, that will still be equal. So I'm going to send this 4 over to be multiplied over here, and then right here, and then right here. So 4 times negative 1 gives us negative 4. That is still going to keep our sign the exact same way, less than or equal to 4 times this 4 will give us 16. 4 times this, I'm just going to keep that written like this, 5 times 4 times v divided by 4. So we can see all the parts that are inside. So this is the point of why we multiplied everything by 4. This 4 is going to reduce with this 4. That will equal 1, right? 4 divided by 4 equals 1. And then we come up with this nice looking inequality where we're just left with this minus 5v right here. So now we have minus 4 is less than or equal to 16 minus 5v. So to simplify, we want to get our whole numbers together. We don't have any more v's to combine with, so we'll just try to get this 16 with this minus 4. So let's do that. Subtract 16. See, this is a positive 16. To move it, we need to do the opposite of 16 on both sides of our inequality, which we're treating like an equation. This gives us a total of negative 20. This 16, subtract 16, gives us 0. And we still have a minus 5v. So now we have negative 20 is less than or equal to negative 5v. Now, in front of that v, we have a negative 5. So we need to do the opposite to get rid of it. So it's being multiplied by negative 5. So we want to divide by negative 5. In inequalities, we have uh, something interesting happen every time we divide or multiply by a negative number. And negative, you might remember from this number line, is the opposite. Here's 0. Here's 1 over here, but this is the opposite, negative 1. Over here we have 2, but over here we have the opposite of 2, negative 2. So we'll, we have this opposite operation happening. So when we divide by this negative 5, we are changing it to go in the opposite direction. So we are going to have to switch our sign from a less than sign to a greater than and equal to sign. So this negative 5 reduces to 1, and we're just left with v on this side. Negative 20 divided by negative 5 gives us a positive 4. So our answer is 4 is greater than or equal to v.